When I think about our graduate program here in theology, I, th I really think about it, it's kind of a second model of graduate programs in theology. Because one way to imagine graduate programs in theology is you have an undergraduate uh, education. You might major in theology, you might not, but you do major in something. You specialize a little bit. And then you go into a graduate program and you specialize even more. Okay? Yeah. Um, and, you know, we do. We have specialists in this department in scripture, history of Christianity, comparative theology of religions, uh, philosophical theology, ethics. We have, we do have specialists and we hope that our students want to figure out what their focus is, and especially in that sense. But that's not the goal of our program. Our goal of our program, in fact, is to uh, create a, we have a community of scholars, and I think among our students we want to create a community of scholarship um, that integrates all those. So that even among our faculty, our people in scripture have to know things about the history of Christianity and they have to know about contemporary theology. And the people in contemporary theology have to know what's going on in Old Testament studies as well as New Testament, as well as all the stuff that's going on in social history of the tradition. Um, you know, the people in you know, comparative theology doing work, whether it's in, in Buddhism or whether it's in Islam, have to also know what's going on in American pragmatism and philosophical theology, as well as knowing on scripture. So that we're trying to produce, I think, we have a department and we're trying to offer an educational program that, uh, that trains students in how to engage in this kind of conversation among each other. No matter what, they're, they're, they'll have their focal interest, but, but that won't be enough. I mean, they'll have to be able to engage other people's focal interests as well. That's what we're hoping.